YouTube. <sighs> Hello, I thought I'd do a video to catch up with everybody because obviously I haven't been around for a, on YouTube for a bit. So I've been watching a lot of lovely videos out there though. So um, yeah, lots of inspiration has been coming my way. Um, anyway, I just thought um, as I've um, kind of been poorly again. Uh, what do you do when you're poorly? Oh yeah, shop. So I think everybody does that, don't they? <laughs> Got your iPad out and you're shopping online just to make you feel better. Right, so I did buy a few bits when I was poorly and uh, I'm going to share them with you. Now some of these bits I purchased and my daughter, my seven, she's 17 and she's um, she's got autism and and um, she's she was the one that started me on the scrapbooking process so um, anyway the stuff that I'm, some of the stuff I'm going to show you she's already taken half of it so <laughs> I did say I'll share it with her so apologies for that um, I didn't have a choice she saw them and took them so um, but they were full when I bought them <laughs> Anyway, I'm going to start with this. I, I, I went to um, a hobby craft and um, I bought myself a little journaling book um, to put to use with the um, uh, the Project Life. Um, I'm not. I, I, I think because I bought some pocket pages um, for my scrapbook. I'm not going to do Project Life. As it is, but I thought I would use the the pages to do some layouts in that style, if you understand what I mean. Um, instead of um, doing the, a full-on project life, which I might do next year now. Um, but I've got to catch up. <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm behind everybody else, and I've got to catch up. I've done one layout, and I've, as I said before, I've got my class booked. Um, for next month and I'm look, looking forward to that so anyway I bought this little book which has got um, just journaling pages in um, which I thought was interesting and then I also got some of uh, um, some of these um, cards uh, the, I think there's about 30 of the um, of the uh, these are double sided but on the other side they are just like plain but with grids on or journaling um, sheets and stuff like that. They're quite nice but they're not very good quality, they're quite flimsy um, and I got these from a seller on eBay so I suppose you get what you pay for. Yeah, But this was just a starter because obviously I've not done it before but some of these are really nice some of them, um, I don't know if you can see what I'm doing to be fair and I hope you can that's the one that says currently um, remember this uh, uh, the good life I mean some of them are really quite good I mean I, I quite like some of these too which I thought um, was quite funky that you could actually put some of your photographs on I quite like that one too it's an arrow but it's shaped like a house <laughs> I thought that's quite quirky um, yeah so I got myself a pack of those oh, look hello sunshine um, here and now and hello yeah so they were quite nice and um, and also the um, four by sixes um, uh, this is life T today is a gift uh, lovely hearts there as I say on the back it's just like a spotted grid they're all and this one says this is the story of our hearts which I thought was quite nice enjoy today so anyway yeah and you know and there's more but I'm not going to sit here and go through the whole lot with you I'll be here forever right I also um, whilst I was poorly on, uh, online I um, picked up some dies um, and these are cottage cuts um, 
scrapping cut cottage i picked up the hello die um and i picked up the thanks die so um i got those they were quite sweet haven't yet used them so looking forward to using them um and also um uh, went to um, our local pound shop, which would be your dollar store, I suppose, in America, if you're watching and you're American, um, and picked up some um, nice little bits in there. Now, this is where my daughter has taken some of the stuff because um, I picked up some paper clips. So they're doing some nice paper clips, and there was like these little ducks. Now, there was 10 on this card, as you can see, 10, but she took half of them. So she took half of those, <laughs> and then there's the apple ones, and she took half of those as well, little apples, and then there's little fish, and she took half of those as well. So they were from our pound shop, and then there was these binder clips as well, and these were really sweet, there was like butterfly design on this side, and a heart design, and you only got six um, on this card, but she took one of each. So, so, you know, she did quite well <laughs> for me. Yep, any, and then I got some, um, I bought myself some cheap watercolours because I wanted to have a dibble dabble at doing a bit of watercolouring. I've not done it before, so before I went out and spent a lot of money on um, an expensive set of watercolours, I just thought I'd give it a go with some, um, these are made by... Brunel Franklin um, and they're quite quite cute and you know so I thought I'd give them a go um, and also from the pounds those paints were from the pound shop by the way <laughs> just thought I'd point that out um, but these were and I, and I bought some of these before and I just went back to get some more because I thought they were brilliant brilliant value and these are jute rolls or burlap or whatever you want to call it but this one's in a cream colour this one's in like a crafty brown colour um, this one's in a pink colour a lovely colour that one and then this one's um, a nice green not sure what I'd do with the green but Easter's coming up so that's quite an eastery colour so I could do that there um, yeah, and then um, I picked up some craft tags from um, Wilkinson's or Wilco now, I think they like to be called, some craft ones. I didn't have any craft card tags, so I picked, I mean, yes, I could cut out my own tags, but I haven't got the time. So I just picked up some of these. Um, another thing I picked up um, was some not used this before but I picked up some metallic gilding wax um, this one is autumn bronze and this one is pewter so I picked up some of them so I'm looking forward to using those um, yeah they look they looked quite good so I thought I'd give them a go um, and then um, I also found a little mini stamp set and this I think I got from the range and that's made by Dovecraft. I think there's quite a few of these around and you can pick them up quite um, quite a lot over here. But I wanted something to um, do a little bit of text work on my um, scrapbooks when I, you know, when I um, get going with them. Um, so I thought that would be quite cute and I can make my own little embellishments and words using those so that was quite good and then um i found a lady on um, facebook and um she was selling these and yes there was four <laughs> again my daughter took one um these are a little bicycle um clips and they were really pretty i really like these i mean me and my husband and my daughter when i'm well we do a lot of bike riding and i've got some photographs of us on on our bikes and everything so um that's why i got these um so that would be great for our layouts when i do those um, I got them from if anyone's interested in here in the UK I got them from a, um, a site called Storm in a Teacup 
um, I hope you can see that it uh, yeah so th the website's called storm in a teacup so I'll put that up there again so you can see it um, yeah so that I got them and then um, in um, the range I managed to find a really good deal and I bought a hundred hundred twelve by twelve basil cardstock for a great great value of just twenty pounds and I thought that was fantastic value and all different colours look some of them are, are textured um, but what great value look at those so I was really chuffed with those excellent that was and then um, and then again in hobby um, craft again in hobby craft I found this and I'm really excited <laughs> to be working with this 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 is obviously Tilda paper pad and it's the tiny treasures and um, this was eight pounds can you believe that eight pound I can't believe that myself and it is um, 24 double sided sheets including cut out sheets and three of each design so I can just flip through I hope you can see these not really doing this very well lovely papers there's your cut outs cut outs and the, in these here are your, your die, die cut sheets all cut out for you so yes I was so happy with that eight pounds and then, and I'm going to, going to move the camera for this when I get I so I'm just going to clear my desk so that I can show you this in a different angle. Let me just clear everything away. Oh, sorry about this. I'm not, I'm not very organised, am I? 